fire on the mountain as IPOP react to Namdekano's trial. See what they vow to do next. I greet everyone listening to this very broadcast this very day. Yes, this is today's news. Yes, um, the IPOP members are taking the laws into your hand, their hands this time for the reverse. They say they don't, that Tunubu don't, don't overdo, that uh, they can no longer wait, that they, they have tolerated and they have swallowed enough ink and sinker that now they are going to take the law into their hands this time. Hmm. My people, when I will fear, fear. Let's quickly check the content. This is today's news. The indigenous people of Biafra IPOP has vehemently opposed the ongoing trial of its leader, Mazi Namdi Kanu, asserting their steadfast adherence to the judgment of the appeal court, which mandated that Kanu should not face further trial in any Nigerian court. A recent development saw a federal high court in Abuja fixing another adjournment as the date for ruling on a fresh bill application filed by the embattled IPOP leader. Additionally, it has been marked for a recommendation and a recommencement of the trial. In response to these proceedings, Ima Powerful, the spokesperson of the pro Front group, urged President Bola Tunubu to unconditionally release Namne Kanu, emphasizing that the federal government lacked substantial evidence against the leader. Highlighting the legal backdrop, Powerful reiterated that the Supreme Court on December 15, 2023 referred Kano's case back to the High Court, which slated clearly February 8, 2024. For the recommencement of hearing, however, the federal government failed to appear in court on a specific date, indicating, according to Kano, a lack of justifiable grounds for Kano's prosecution. Asserting their stance, powerful stated, IPOP leadership has reviewed the action of the federal government and the legal system, and we totally stand on no further trial of our leader in the High Court or any other court. The group staunchly stands by the appeal court's decision to discharge and acquit Kano. Since the Supreme Court have declared Namde Kano free and also they have discovered that the IPOP leader is not uh, guilty of any crime, so why are they now, you know, um, doing what they are doing? Why can't they leave Namde Kano to go away? Now, it's in be their own. <laughs> My people, this kind of thing we then they do for office, eh? Another shout, so another shout, another shout. All right. Um, I think Ima Papa has spoken well. If I were Paula Ahmed Tunubu, I would just listen and let this guy go. And let this guy go. Let him go. Let him be free. And there will be peace in the Southeast. In the enjoy with the album for the Southeast. In the enjoy them. All right, uh, dear listeners out there, now you can now hear this. This is exactly what is going on right now in court concerning the freedom of Mazi Namdi Kano. What is your own opinion about this and what do you think? Please and please and please let's quickly hear from you and then let's know what your opinion and what your take is. Don't forget to leave your comment below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated. Each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.